Welcome back to Let's Play Batman Arkham Origins, Burning Dog fans. It's something I've been wanting to do for a while now. I haven't quite gotten the chance, so I'm just going to go ahead and do it. See if this still works. Huh. Whoa. There's big old eels and stuff down there. And none of them have skeletons. Awesome. That's an old looking slot machine. Some kind of vintage thing. Ah, my ancient foe. Well, we'll see who's laughing now. But this was the elevator. Yay! Candy! Real name unknown. Penguin's assistant. Brown eyes, black hair. Da, 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 da. Using Penguin for income. Criminal record exists only in association with Penguin. Potential for rehabilitation. Candy was raised on the streets, managed to pull herself up and earn a business degree. Unfortunately, lean times in a contracting job market. And a contracting job market caused her to fall in with Penguin's crowd. The recession has driven many well-educated people to take desperate action to support themselves, so it's no excuse for criminal behavior. Her crimes are minor, however, making her an excellent candidate for rehabilitation. Oi! You can't do this! I'm claustrophobic, I am! Cobblepot ain't gonna be happy when he hears about this! He's even less happy in here with this. I knew you didn't have what it takes to buy me fair. Make a deal. Oh good! Now the charging boss fight guys are a regular enemy. Damn it! Okay. Oh, you weren't talking to me, sorry. Oh, he is unconscious. Awesome. And stay down. Penguin's enforcer. All that, and he's still just unconscious. Yeah, he's breathing all right. D. Well, fuck you too, then. 
I didn't like. I don't think they did that before. Graded you on every individual encounter. Hello, huh? I have a reading of a Patrick Stewart doing a uh, reverse race version of Othello, where he played Othello and everyone else was played by black actors. Opera is kind of vague, don't you think? Wait, what? Oh, every Tuesday. Never mind, I thought this was something really weird. Behold, the final offer. I ain't see a beauty. And to think I bought her for a song with a band of Somali pirates. Hey, we're gonna sell her for scrap if you can believe it. <laughs> Now, she weren't always called a final offer. That was my work of genius. <laughs> In a previous life, she was the hybrid cargo cruise liner Olivia B. Meredith, a proud old ship indeed. They don't build them like this anymore. Tough as nails, and with all the amenities a man could want. Those pirates don't know what they let slip through their fingers. I like that Penguin has this megalomaniacal... You know, no, not make him, I call egocentric thing going on. Or he, uh... He just sets up these weird buttons with display cases, and he, you know, he did this in Arkham City, too, where he's, like, showing off the different guns that he has for sale, or, you know, he, he puts some of his dead enemies in a, in a box and lets you hear about him, gloat about them. Like he murdered the Joker's pet hyenas, stuffed them and put them in a display box with a button like that. Commissioner promises to end rampant police brutality. Huh, weird. Ollie ollie oxen free. Ooh, loading. You gotta know Mr. Falcone is not gonna stay for this. Clearly. Maybe you should shut your mouth and pray your boss tells my boss what he wants to know. Else both of you are gonna be, what do you guys say? Swimming. Swimming with the fishes? Oh, that's original. You think of that yourself, you low class boy? One more word. I'm waiting for that guy. And it begins. Now, if they don't know already that this is what Batman does, then this would be even more terrifying. Like, it's bad enough in the other games, and their immediate response is Batman is here. I don't think we're gonna last too long at this rate. There's nothing we can do for him. We gotta look out for other levels. He's got to just blown up like a thing. How am I gonna unlock this room? It's wide open and full of possibilities. I'm gonna stare at the fucking wall, man. I know you're AI, but come on. Oh! Damn it. I really wish I had the sonic battering. It comes in so handy in these places. I just look up, uh... Oh no, that was one of these, wasn't it? Worst Nightmare, rank 3. Damn it, it was uh, this thing. I can do that.
You know, I was planning on hanging all these guys up, but whatever. I can do this. Buttons I can press to lure these guys to a specific area. Thou shalt not steal from the penguin. And there's a dead man in there. Of course! Hello, what have we here? That's a thing, all right. I just can't reach it. Oh. Come on. Yes, no? I guess it wouldn't unlock it right away anyway. Be patient, yeah. I wasn't literally working off a clock the last time I did this, but... There's only... Two guys left. Uh-oh. Huh. He doesn't care. I guess they're doing the same thing as before. Huh! I saw that. He kicked the guy. It was funny. No, he's not calling everybody over there. Interesting. <laughs> Knockout Smash knocks him out instantly, so I don't have to, you know, stand there exposed for those few seconds. But it's really loud. what's missing. Someone over the uh, PA system telling them every time I knock someone out and making fun of them. Content not supported. Okay. I just got a very strange email from my father. Not email, text message. I bet he sat on the phone again. could probably just glide kick and take him out. Well, it would be pretty effortless. But I want to make sure it counts as me doing this without being a scene. Uh 
Bitches! Yes! Mmm! Delicious! Legion Reward, Sonic Batarang. Once deployed, the Sonic Batarang gives off a high-pitched sound, luring an enemy to investigate. Use this to distract enemies or lead them into traps. A short recharge time is required between each use. Uh, also, it looked pretty. Sort of nearby. Yeah, heartbeat monitors. Uh, in the previous games, uh, the bad guys who are in the Predator rooms had these, you know, pulse monitors that would sound an alarm if they, uh, fell unconscious. You know, it would keep track of their pulse, and if it fell to a certain beats per minute, then it would... Ooh. Then, yes, it would, uh... alert the other guys, and it'd all run over. They did this so that the Sonic... You know, make it clear that the Sonic Batarang only works in Predator rooms. You can't lure, like, uh one dude in a, a random crowd off to the side so you can beat him up. Let's check the timer. Oh, what the hell. Hello there. What do you want? I didn't do nothing. Who's your boss? What does Penguin want with him? Alberto Falcone. But I got no idea what Penguin wants with him, I swear. Alberto Falcone, professional criminal in Gotham City. Son of mob boss Carmine Falcone. Medical records indicate history of mental illness. Falcone is one of Gotham's most powerful crime families. Carmine Falcone has ruled as part of the city for years, but has started losing ground to newcomers Black Mask and Cobblepot. Still, the Falcone family remains active throughout Gotham, posing a threat to the safety and security of its citizens. Oh, and I remembered something. I was complaining that the, uh... The... D database bios don't have the most interesting facts about these guys. Like, for example, uh, Roman Sionis, the the black mask he wears, it's carved from the wood of his father's coffin. I should give you an idea of this man's mental state. So, damn, I've got more than half of them already. I don't know what your game is, but old man Falcone will be in your debt if you take Cobblepot down. He's right through that door back there. No thanks. I don't need the Falcones in my debt. Old Gotham surveillance. Ah, uh, someday I'm going to miss the days when criminals didn't wear masks. Hey, Mr. Rebels. Oh. Now, where were we? Candy. You suggested little Alberto over here. Hey, baby. Try to convince his father to take early retirement. He disagreed and called you a, let's see, psychotic little bastard. No, 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 Listen, Falcone. Because this is the last time I'll ask. What are you gonna tell your father? That we're getting out of the weapons business. I promise. I'll make him do it. <laughs> I'll see your lips flapping, Bernie. But they ain't making the sound I wanna hear. You idiots better kill me, please! Don't hurt me! Don't stand here and kill him! Got you right where I will on you, bloody wipers! Punch him in the face! What are you waiting for? 
Tom Tom. Are you waiting for a person or in the Hey, you can interrupt that. How about that? Boom! Now then. Now hold on. Hold on a minute. I seen your act. I ain't done nothing you not done. Stop! Black mask. Put a bounty on my head. Where is he? I don't kick tabs on him in Giza with a grudge. You're not a popular bloke in this town. You're running out of time. Wait, wait. Lacey Towers. There was a murder. It was supposed to be his same house. But all black man did. He's got problems of his own, I'd say. Someone broke in there. Fuck. Oh crap. Just stroke the Terminator, ladies and gentlemen. It appears the game is over before it even begins. I'm not playing games, Slade. Tell me where I can find Black Mask. I'm Burning Dogface, and as much as I hate to leave it at such an exciting moment, we're really out of time now. I'll see you guys in the next episode of Let's Play Ar Batman Arkham Origins. When we face off against the one, the only... Deathstroke. Later!